Hey Crafty Besties, it's your Crafty Bestie Tabitha. I am going to complete the challenge of making the four tags from Rory. So you remember last week I made this one. And, oh, not that one, this one. No beauty shines brighter than that of a good heart. True, true. And that's Georgie. And that's me and George. He's our crafty bestie, too. Mm-hmm. And so I'm working with this piece of leftover craft paper. And Rory sent this piece of paper that she made with paint and tissue napkin. That little white piece of napkin. So I'm just going to... Put some brushed corduroy on the edges just to age it up a little bit. Let it go with the theme of the tags I'm working on. And I'm going to use this, which had a misprinted thing on it. But that's okay. That's, that's why we do what we do with junk journaling. We take our junk. And we make beautiful things out of it. So I'm going to get some Aline's Tacky Glue. Not endorsed or sponsored or any of those things by anybody. Just telling you what I'm using. And no, I think I went this way. So we're going to make another tag for George's journal. Now I made this one. And the glue hasn't dried yet as you can see because there's that wet spot. And that's a magazine photo, a Tim Holtz paper doll, some of this kind of trim right here. That's this. I don't, I got it in a Happy Mail. I'm so excited. I love Happy Mails because you never know what you're going to get. And then a piece of ribbon. And some faux washi is underneath that. So that's the, the third tag in the series of the tags. So, let's see. Now, I thought it appropriate, since it was little George and Tabby, never give up, marry George and Tabby, be happy, and congratulations, and George, because he's George, that I would make George and Tabby be expecting, because that woman looks like she's expecting. And I got a piece of paper stuck to the George face. That's no good. <laughs> there we go. And these are Tim Holtz paper dolls because that's me being the age I am. Playing with paper dolls. But I love how just a little bit of the Distress Oxide really brings them out and helps them pop out on the paper. I'm going to get my regular old Elmer's glue because that really sticks these paper dolls just fine. Oop, bring them down. <coughs> Excuse me. Oh. It's been that kind of week in customer service too. Did y'all have a rough week or was that just me this week? Good Lord, people were on crazy trains this week. Want me to do things I can't do. Mm -mm -mm. I'm going to edge up. And it kind of takes the misprint effect away down here. Makes it look like the paper was supposed to have some pattern to it. I'm not going to go all the way around the top just yet. Because I don't exactly know what the top is going to look like. But. Have hope. Oh, a new beginning. That's what this one should say. A new beginning. And I got these little stickers off Timu. So, I don't know if y'all use Timu or not, but I, I've ordered a couple times, and I don't know yet if I'm impressed or not. We're going to put a new beginning because those two, totally new beginning. 
Because you see, she's expecting. Just her baby bump is just showing. And then I have these stickers from the Dollar Tree. And I really like the, that one that says, We Are Family. We are family. I got stickers from the Dollar Tree. <laughs> Sorry. You all. You all know me. And if you don't know me, you should hang out and get to know me. Thanks for stopping by if you don't know me. I'm going to do the... Oh. There. Now it's got the tag top look to it. We're going to finish. Yeah, the We Are Family is not quite aged. Wonder. Go around it a little. Oh well. I thought it was cute and fun. And we're going to put this over here. Because it kind of nods to the little gift that they are having in their new beginning. Yeah. See? Oh. And that tag didn't take as long as my other tags took last week. Maybe I was just tired and not perking along too great. Oh my goodness. So it's been a tough week in customer service. Thought I'd just toss it out there to you that sometimes Tabby doesn't always have a great week. And so if you're not having a great week, you're not alone. And I think I want to take this because this is really good cardboard and this is my thing that I messed up because I printed on the sides instead of up and down and it's really Cricut paper I'm just going to smush it down right here and see what we can make out of it it's not part of the four tag challenge, but it seems like it could be. And we can make it like a journaling card for inside the George Journal. And family is super important to us. I'm just going to cut out the edges. And see, that's the cool thing about if you stick it on there wrong, it doesn't matter because you're going to cut it out anyway. But y'all, the Dollar Tree has amazing stickers. And they're so pretty right now in the springtime. Um, but this week in customer service is pretty rough. Some people were fairly unkind and it makes me sad because I know everybody in our world is struggling right now and the economy is hitting us all pretty hard times are tough all over and people who normally might not have asked for anything they're asking and sometimes I can and sometimes I can't do what they ask me but I'm going to tell you something that's not approved by my company your your appliances do have a lifespan what that lifespan is i'm not sure but i am pretty sure that it's not gonna be 30 years anymore okay and the warranty is not gonna last you for 30 years so if you call somewhere because something isn't working Treat them like they're your family. If you get along with your family. Be nice. Don't try to not be ugly to them. Because they're trying the best they can. So we're going to have to cover this back. And I think I want to cover it with this coffee dyed coffee filter. Because I think that it will give us just a perfect writing surface. It won't 
completely cover this up down here. But it, it, it'll darken it down if I put it this way. It'll darken it down enough to make it usable. So let's do that. And we're going to do that with our art glitter glue. Because our glitter glue, I'm sorry y'all, this is stuff is, is worth it. I didn't think it would be. But it totally is. Um, if you have tips for me about how to keep my art glitter glue flowing good, please tell me that in the comments below. Because I have a heck of a time with my art glitter glue with the fine tip. Getting it to flow smooth. If I haven't worked in the, all my journaling stuff in a few days. It, it's hard to get it going good. But I keep running that pen up and down the little tip. But if you have tips of how to keep it from blocking up as bad. Please share with me. Because I will share every tip I know with you. Regardless of if you share that tip with me or not. But if you have a way that you keep your art glitter glue from... I'm going to try to raise that up some. If you have ways to keep your art glitter glue from getting really super sticky and unable to... I mean, like, I'm really squeezing hard here. And I don't know about y'all, but some of us are getting older. And squeezing that hard is not necessarily great for our hand. It hurts. I'm going to push it out to the edge. Ooh, sorry, y'all. Maybe some of y'all can help me with knowing what the best way to uh, get that is. Now I'm just going to tear it. Because I like the jaggedy edge. And then I'm going to use those bits on these corners here. I'll just put it there. I'm going to put another little bit of glue here. Take this piece. Put it here. This side down. I mean, you'd be amazed at the things you can coffee dye. Because this is a coffee dyed coffee filter. Which I think is a pretty good idea. And if it's not a coffee filter, I'm sorry, Rory, you can tell me what it is. But it is the right shape to be a coffee dyed coffee filter. Missed a good opportunity if it isn't one. Oh, yeah, shoot. I might should have used some Mod Podge for that. I like Mod Podge. Mod Podge makes me happy. And I don't know if y'all can hear that thunder on my microphone. I don't tear it too bad. But it is thundering and raining here in East Tennessee today. And uh, it's a good day to be in the craft room. And for those who have asked, yes, Jasper is doing well. He's over here eating a bone in the little corner. I think about Pam and Sonny when, when I talk about Jasper because he's so funny. Yeah. Okay. okay. I'm going to let this be a journaling spot. We're going to turn it back over here. This is a tag punch that I got from Amazon. Thank you, Rory, for the recommendation. And that is Rory from Coffee and Crafting with Rory. And she's an amazing artist, y'all. She's so good. So, 
family. Home sweet home. That almost goes in that as a frame. Pretty much take care of the rule of three. I don't know. Y'all have to tell me if I messed it up too much. This little bonus journaling spot. This is not even a tag. So this is not even part of that challenge. So y'all don't come at me too hard for messing it up. You know how sometimes you mess something up and then you just keep working with it. And keep working with it and keep working with it. If you use the brush corduroy, it pretty much matches normal coffee dyed things. It kind of gives you that same patina and takes the white edge off. So it looks cohesive. So. So yes, warranties aren't forever. Your appliances won't last forever. And whatever you do, don't run the self-clean on your oven before a holiday. Your family is not impressed. If your family is going to love you, they're going to love you anyway. Let's see if we can get some family going on this. Yes. Like the aunts and the uncles. Let's see if we can get some cousins. Oh, a group of men in these paper dolls. Y'all know these Tim Holtz paper dolls are the bomb. And the uncle and the cousins. Yeah. Maybe these are the sisters. Aline's tacky glue is how I'm going to glue these down. Why? Because it's what I reached for. Oh, sorry about the camera. I have the sisters. We're going to have a couple of aunties. and uncle love right here and what else who else we got groups oh yeah here we go you got the uncle the uncle crew right here <laughs> this is family and if y'all don't have a big family you can be part of mine because we have a big family and we got all kinds of people in it. We got every color in it. And it don't matter. And we got red and yellow, black and white. And I promise you, they're all loved and all cared for. You got the quiet ones. You got the vibrant ones. <laughs> I guess I can put her on here because I think that'd be funny. Because this would be something I would do. I never did dance ballet or anything, but this child in this picture, you know, there's always that one cousin. Well, that one cousin would be me. Oh, put the glue right on my face. There we go. I'm glad that dries clear. <laughs> so, thanks for coming and hanging out with me. Thank you in advance for not running the self-clean option on your oven. And don't forget to love your family. Aunts, uncles, cousins, brothers, sisters. You know, you might have some crafty bestie cousins. You don't even know they're your crafty cousins. I found that out about some of mine. That's pretty awesome. 
Uh, shout out to my crafty cousin Tammy, my crafty cousin Mikey, and his crafty child, and my crafty cousin Gabby, and my crafty niece Jessica and Lydia, my crafty nephew Julian. I mean, there's there's all kinds of us out there. Um, so here's I know the challenge was four tags. It wasn't I didn't have anything to do with this, but that was just a fun bonus piece. Okay. So here's my four challenge tag. Oh, this one doesn't have a ribbon. <gasps> Yellow it is. Crap. I almost messed up, didn't I? Mm -hmm, I almost messed up. Come on, Aline's Tacky Glue. Don't fail me now. Yeah, I might be out of it. I might be out of Aline. Let's see if I can just get enough to stick it down. Well, shoot. Okay, Elmer. Uncle Elmer, help me out. Let's stick some glue right here. I'm going to stick this in here and press it down and that'll give us a nice loop so tag one happy congratulations tag two no beauty shines brighter than that of a good heart tag three never give up tag four a new beginning we are family and no, I'm not pregnant. Just, no. Um, but don't forget your family. That's my bonus for today. Don't forget, even if you don't have your family around you, you are kind. You matter. And you are enough. Your crafty bestie Tabby loves you, even if she cannot keep the, the camera from shaking. But I do. I love you all very much. Thanks for stopping by. Have a great day. I'll see you next time.